Hello. Welcome back to Mover Ruins Movies. It's been a while. Gonky, you're here. Hello, Mover. We're going to ruin uh, Firefox by popular demand. I've never seen the movie. This is a first take, first look. Gonky's seen it. So, no spoilers, please, Gonky. Uh, <laughs> yeah. But just 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 in case, views are our, our own and do not represent that of the DoD. Let us begin with Firefox. My first time watching it. Gonky, you got anything to say before we ruin it? Oh, by the way, we know it's just a movie. I don't know why I have to say <laughs> that, but we know it's just a movie. And we know it's not really real or uh, or representing something that did not happen. <laughs> Correct. Or some words thereof. I love the people that are like, shut up and watch the movie. Well, then that would just be you renting the movie and us sitting here in silence. We'll look at a picture of us while we watch the movie. I, I actually love this movie, but I I watched it when I was a kid, like a dozen times. Nice. It's hard to ruin a Clint Eastwood movie, man. Yeah, but we'll try. Yeah. What a man. He's got a beard and everything, dude. You know, I worked at a uh, flight school that was called Firefox Aviation because the owner, he loved this movie. <laughs> really? Yeah, it was in Ball Ground, Georgia. Yeah, Cherokee County Airport. Is he running to them or from them? Dude, that's... Look, we're trying to get to you about your car's extended warranty. <laughs> no, this is a guy who's got a DD-214 who's trying to <laughs> be recalled from the IRR. He's yeah. like, no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, we've got... We have a mission for you. Not available. I'm running. You can't run from the Lord. It looks like uh, Old Eastwood didn't do as well as Maverick did in his retirement years. He's not living in a hangar with a P-51. Oh, dude, he's, he's serious. He's <laughs> he's shooting back. He looks like Wolverine. Dude, look at that flying. Oh, that's yeah. awesome. Yeah, that's, pre that's pretty cool, yeah. Oh, boy. I can't... F-105, F-4? That's the WW Vietnam. Yeah, he's having flashbacks. Did he change jets? Be a thud driver or a phantom driver? And Clean Eastwood, dude. Both. <laughs> he's flying, so he's not a Wizzo. No. So he's a thud driver. Yeah. Vietnam was not kind to thud drivers. I reckon not. CGI in this movie is excellent. Yeah, I said, what? <laughs> Early 80s, right? Yeah, I oh didn't boy. look at the date. <laughs> Sir. Right you again. I like the yeah. beard. Oh, he's a major. That's good. Sorry we had to surprise you like that. <laughs> Come on, get him out of here. Your PT test is due. Nick, it, We're here. <laughs> what? This Why is the dude's visor down? Like, put your visor up. Because he's random henchman number sixty-nine. You will make out the main hangar. Could be straight to the mission. All business. Our theoretical weapon strategist stood before NATO command to explain, with much confidence, that it would take the Soviets a minimum of ten years. To develop a Mach 5 aircraft with thought Mach 5 systems. I stand before you wow. today to explain. That's pretty fast. Fred, Hollywood has a fascination with speed. At 0400 <laughs> hours on, uh, Soviets have developed some sort of anti radar capability for the aircraft. Oh, stealth Five before stealth was cool. To all intents and purposes. Yep. Invisible. 
All right, Captain, uh, you came 5,000 miles for this. Let's hear it. Captain Buckle, sir. 5,000 miles, where is he? Now? Still keeping in shape. That's good. A lot of people miss you back home, Major. And they still talk about you, wherever you put Lure, it. this is going to be you. All the guys in the aggressor squadron think you must have sprouted wings. I'm Go trying on. to grow the beard right now. <laughs> One hell of a time track. He was an aggressor. <laughs> yep. Look at these figures. 50,000 pounds thrust per. These dimensions deliver an excess of a capacity of 100%. Combat ceiling... 120,000 feet. 120,000 feet. It's Note the Dark the Star, dude. Capacity. Thomas Cruise flew it. Dark star. Speed yeah. is in excess of Mach 5, even Mach 6, and able to maintain it. Our best body design begins to melt. So it's hypersonic. Mach 3. I think it should be very clear why the Soviets were willing to... We've been to hypersonic before it was hypersonic. Like a genius in... At least talking about it. Physics, yes. But still a prisoner. Little did they know this the Russian, true. the Soviet Our Union was collapsing is, at the time. As far as we can ascertain, <laughs> no way the, the bolts would fall off as it flew. Couples radar and infrared <laughs> detection devices. The steel rivet. Thought guided, thought yeah. controlled arsenal on board the plane rattled itself Look apart. The thought guided actual brain emission translated. They've got thought guided weapons. Through Imagine in his helmet. Whatever target. target Thought crimes? If you think the wrong destroyed. thing, you get an LOR. Oh, dude. Oh, it auto generates. It's shoot. got like a little printer in the combat. Yeah. Cockpit. Or on one of his scopes. His thought impulses are guiding a missile to that threat. What this amounts to, gentlemen. Well, what if it's a guy flying and every five seconds it's boobs? Reaction and boobs. Time boobs. Like. Over any <laughs> defensive system we have today. <laughs> If the Soviets can mass what, produce I, it, I can't control my thoughts. So I would not be a good yeah, fit for the Firefox. When I, ran, <laughs> I get bored, I start randomly thinking, no, man. We at the, uh, I wonder what a barrel roll would be like. Oh, God, I'm in Mach 6. No. Yeah. Over G. Over G. Over G. We need you to fly again. There's, there's no more. That's a tender area to broach with you. I read your POW files. I Shirtless in the, in the lake. <laughs> you for myself take it about but i don't think that this hold on hold on where's the you? dog there's, if there's no <laughs> dogs it's not mover anymore. you go back there and tell them that this is an air force major but you want me to fly yes we want you to fly we want you to fly the greatest war plane ever built for the airlines well i don't trust <laughs> an operation this way we didn't expect you to be happy with it general we're aware of his health record, but his mother is Russian. He's spoken the language since childhood and is exactly... Oh, dude, he didn't have a security clearance. Off with a suit and cockpit of fitted. No chance. I mean, the operation is reduced to the decision that he fits the pressures. We've got three months to train you. It's getting you there. That's the problem. Oh? Can you commit to three months or five months of training, Russia. Mover? No. You've got to pass. <laughs> Let's do it in a week. If we can't do it in a week, I'm not interested. Working with our Soviet operatives around the clock, and I am now quite confident that they can place a man in successful proximity with the plane. As far as I'm concerned, we require only two things of this man, that he speak the language and, and the Dutch. fly a plane like the devil himself. Oh. This is suicide, Buckles. And that's exactly why it'll work. They'll never expect it. It's too unthinkable for them to ever defend. We'll get you on that airplane. All you have to do is fly it. Hell you guys yeah. Are amazing, you know? Yeah. We need you, Major. You're the best we've got. <laughs> oh, you'll find somebody. Oh, There's yeah. a lot of guys who could fly that plane. You fly it. I don't have wings. Not with your qualifications. <laughs> we need your acting, Gary. What is it shooting? Phasers? <laughs> Photon torpedoes. Dan, you're approaching stall speed. Oh, that's just the bad graphics of that year. Yeah. On course, on glide slope. Oh, she's Slide doing a PAR. Oh, nice landing. The PAR. Way. Yeah, he landed okay, off the runway, but it's you. fine. I've seen enough. Good enough for government work. He had to do one PAR. That's his NATOPS check. His check ride was a PAR. Yeah. <laughs> Standard government qualification. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, you I'm in. You probably realize by now you're not going to be waltzing into Moscow as Mitchell Gant. 
Our contacts will simply disappear. What about Gan? I didn't realize that was part of the bargain. You can't risk exposing the network. He's a major, sir. One man. Expendable. I understand. <laughs> Third damage doesn't. To succeed, won't you? He didn't do his PME. He's expendable. That's, that's it. That's all I know. That's all you're supposed to know. It's for your own protection. For my protection. You're just going to have to trust us on this. It's not a one of you who think I have a chance that's in the world to pull this off. Crap. Do you think we'd really be going through all this if we believe that? Yes. Yes, I do, actually. See in your face. I do believe you would go oh. through with it if you believe that. That better not be a Bud Light. <laughs> Oh boy. What is this? Fingertip of beam sets. Hey, but you know what? Aileron roll. Aileron roll. Good on him. Good on him for using real airplanes. Hell yeah. They must have told the pilots, just do as many aileron rolls as you can. Look, it's the same briefing room that debrief room they use in Top Gun. Zone five and extend. <laughs> the two stars watching your ACMI. That's not a good sign. He flies in a suit. Oh boy. Yep, it's the airport. Of course, even in the 80s, they had the van. <laughs> we don't walk to our jets. Well, General, it looks like we're off. We step to the van. Between you and me, <laughs> I think you can pull it off. General, I have no idea. You never tell a general that. Always make something up. <laughs> oh, there we go. The one guy in the back is out of sync. He's probably going to go to the gulag after this movie. <laughs> That's why he's not in the lead of that formation mover. <laughs> yeah, he's new. <laughs> okay, what now with the arm? What are we doing? We cannot be too cautious at this late point in time. Victor, you will pass that on as soon as you arrive. Consider it done. Nah. We'll make a fine compliment to the dog. We do our mission planning in the hotel room. Very good. We cannot tell. I want to see the script. He will walk for a really long time. <clears throat> How does he even have the script for this part? They're like, Clint Eastwood, just, just, just do a walk. Clint Eastwood would do. That's right. Yeah, I'm going for a walk. Uh-oh. Who's following him? Natasha. The love interest, right? I can't remember, dude. I When I was a little kid, I cared more about the airplanes than the girls. <laughs> so I, I don't remember that part of the movie. I don't know what kind of watch that is. Elgin Steel. Uh, we could ask Mach 2 Mike. He sells them. <laughs> Get the 10% off, too. <laughs> With discount code. Your name is Michael Lewis now. You are a tourist staying at the Warsaw Hotel. It is all arranged. Do not worry. Just stay calm. Remove the mustache now. <laughs> His sunglasses are sponsored by Dozen Aldridge. <laughs> oh, dude. Your promo code. <laughs> you get 10% off. Yeah, I told you. No more mustache. Yeah. If they really wanted to make this realistic, he would call in for crew rest now, because I'm sure he's not getting his required amount of sleep. <laughs> Sir, I can't fly this airplane. I'm too tired to think. It won't fly without me thinking. ORM is too high. ORM is too high. <laughs> Sir, the ORM was a seven, and you said that we would have to cancel at a three. I'm stuck in Russia now. Oh, boy. The marching guy from earlier. Yep. He, he marched his ass into the subway. <laughs> That's unsanitary. You're all using the same hand towel. 
that's pretty COVID clean water spread. for a subway. Yeah. Well, not with not with the <laughs> same hand towel. Oh boy. Is he pooping? What's the face? I think it was that food, right? Yeah, the rich food. Look at him. I make that same face sometimes. Uh, oh. Jalapeno popcorn does it every time. <laughs> I'm busy. You say MAGA? English oh boy, we're all triggered now. State security. Your papers, please. I'm pooping. Can, can you wait yeah. a minute? Can I finish this <laughs> poop? Do you not smell what the rock is cooking? <laughs> Dude, they just checked the papers. Yeah. Whew, do Your not go in there. <laughs> Are you ill or maybe frightened? I've been having some stomach problems. Do you not smell what just happened in there, sir? I'm gonna have to judo chop you. Yep. Dude, that's some 1930s punching right there. Oh yeah. Clint doesn't need MMA. Oh, man. No. He'll just pummel you with some old man fists. <laughs> we'll use this disgusting towel. There we go. Oh, COVID. COVID. Have some COVID. Here's some more COVID. Where's your mask? Where's your mask? <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Saved. Was he one of the good guys? Sorry. Yep. <laughs> you stupid American. You killed him. He went for his gun. He knew. He's KGB. Do you understand what that means? Who do you? No. One less commie to kill later? I don't, what, 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 Make what? Way quickly to the exit. I just pooped in there. Don't put him in there. Stops you. Obey him. That is the cleanest bathroom of any subway I've ever been to. Why are you going to the bathroom in the subway? I said my papers weren't in order. Oh, so now it looks like he died doing what he loved. Yeah, I just... <laughs> Zemilovsky was at the gasoline station in Kazan. I didn't speak to him, but he was there. He'll be waiting for me after this turn off. Yes, on that road. You're going to have to jump for it. That's about the four wave, mover. Just fly the damn plane. But I don't have crew rest. Oh boy. See ya. Slow down a little. Dude. 52 years old and he can do that i roll out of bed wrong and i'm dead for the rest of the week oh man i'd have to lay there for a bit last with you dr samarovsky where have you been you were checked through the guard post more than an hour ago damn the car broke down the present the five year plan is achieved <laughs> it has still not solved the problem of the moscovich <laughs> open the boat how come nobody speaks russian in russia Nice. Dude, look at the angles. They got the whole stealth idea right. You know, the extreme angles. The F-117. That's pretty advanced for 1982. The, the rest of it's not, but the front Has it got being rudders on the front angled like the that. Yeah. Toe in, dude. Oh, look, yeah, you got yeah. the remove before flight, pedo tomb. That's a terrible place for a yeah. pedo tomb. Uh, uh, sir, without your permission, I've ordered a dog for the guards of security gate three uh, to search the trees in the surrounding area. 
Good blinking. Well done, Tim. Why are they all in English? Oh, in the 80s, they didn't use subtitles. That's right. Americans couldn't read back then. Oh, he's got blue. Blue means something. NATO. Cheeto chow. Oh. Man, in the 80s, you couldn't see anything at night. Uh, karate K. Now you're going to have to fight him later. If you don't kill him now, you're going to have to kill him later. Nope, nope, nope. He's going to fly the spare now. And he's going to be mad. And it's going to be a dogfight. Haven't you seen a movie before, Clint? You know better than this. Search the security building. It's been searched. Colonel. Search it again. Take these two with you. Search the hangar. Search every closet, every stateroom, in every building. He's here. I know it. Sure. Search every outhouse, doghouse, treehouse, and five mile radius. They need Tommy Lee on this. The shower and the shitter. Go, Colonel Vaskov. Thank you.